Good morning, I'm Trish Pahanik, and this is Synopsis, your first early morning briefing. Today is Wednesday, the 22nd of September, 2010. Here are today's top stories. HBO moved quickly to renew its new series, Boardwalk Empire, for a second season after the drama debuted Sunday night. Boardwalk Empire Sunday at 9 p.m. premiere gave the premium cable network its largest debut audience in more than six years. Boardwalk Empire averaged 4.8 million viewers for the first airing at 9 p.m. USA Network tapped Vincent D'Onofrio for Law & Order Criminal Intents, 10th and final season airing in 2011. D'Onofrio played Detective Robert Gorin for eight seasons. USA also gave a pilot commitment for a new project with Wolf Films. E! announced it's expanding its weeknight E! News program from a 30-minute format to a one-hour show beginning on the 25th of October starting at 7 p.m. Ryan Seacrest and Juliana Rancic will continue as primary anchors for the show. MTV offers up an 11th new season of Made next Monday at 4 p.m., chronicling the stories of how young people are turning their dreams into reality. Over at Comedy Central, they're launching new episodes of its animated comedy series, Ugly Americans, starting October 6 at 10.30 p.m. The series centers on Mark Lilly, a social worker at the Department of Integration who helps new citizens, human and otherwise, adapt to life in New York City. Also on October 6th, Cartoon Network introduces the new live-action game show, Hole in the Wall, at 7.30 p.m., hosted by Tech Holmes. Following the premiere of Hole in the Wall, Cartoon Network debuts new episodes of Dude, What Would Happen at 8 p.m. and Destroy, Build, Destroy at 8.30 a and &E Network returns its real-life series, Parking Wars, to its schedule for a fourth season beginning October 12th at 10.30. And NBC is moving forward with a CIA drama, Legends, based on the book of Robert Littell. The drama is about a CIA operative who routinely develops false identities for himself, then wonders if his own identity is fiction. And OWN, the Oprah Winfrey Network, will produce a daily panel talk show, which will premiere in January, cites THR. Now, the daytime talk show at this point will feature multiple hosts similar to ABC's The View. That's a wrap for this Wednesday. Be sure to check your email for the full printed version of today's synopsis with new executive moves and Moran ratings, some new classified ads, a few other bits and pieces that did not make it into this podcast, and remember to check out tonight's primetime broadcast lineup. This is a Synopsis Media production in association with 311 West. For Cynthia Turner, who wrote and compiled Synopsis in Connecticut, I'm Trish Pahanik. I'm going to have a good day. If I make it myself, I'm gonna have a good day. I don't need no one else. I'm gonna have a good day. Nothing wrong I could do. I'm gonna have a good day. Hope you have a good day too.